Well, we've made a lot of progress when it comes to controlling HIV with drugs, but as far as finding a cure, not much has changed. But that could soon change later this month when Sangamo Biosciences releases data showing whether it's able to wipe out the HIV virus using a patient's own cells. Now, if this is successful, it would completely change the way we treat HIV. Patients would now be free of the virus and unable to spread it. Now, what makes HIV so powerful and so different to attack is that it goes after the body's own immune system. The virus attaches itself to a receptor on a T cell, a cell that fights off infection. Then it enters through a doorway called CCR5. Now what Sangamo has done is extract these cells. They genetically alter them so that they don't have that doorway, that CCR5 receptor that the virus needs to get into the healthy cells. The cells are then infused back into a patient without that doorway and they're able to fight off off the virus without being able to get infected themselves. Now, I talked to the company's CEO, and he said that this could revolutionize the way people look at HIV. The goal would really be to go from current therapies, which suppress the virus, to a therapy that actually could create a, a functional cure and uh, have patients go off heart therapy um, and actually have a, a protected part of the immune system that could not be infected by the virus, but would also be uh, competent to destroy the virus and any opportunistic infections that are associated with the AIDS element of, of HIV. Now, if a cure sounds like a long shot, well, it's already happened in one patient, Timothy Brown. Brown received a stem cell transplant in 2007, and the cells from that donor had this natural mutation, so they lacked that doorway that the virus uses to enter the cell, similar to the technology that Sangamo is developing. And since then, he's been off treatment with no signs of the virus. And Brown talked uh, earlier this month to Bloomberg's Rob Waters about his experience. It's really nice to not have to take medication anymore. Um, uh, I have friends who, who have to take them still and um, hopefully this this will be able to um, become a widespread cure for HIV. But giving a patient a risky stem cell transplant like Brown's really isn't practical, and that's where Sangamo hopes its technology comes in. Now, the technology has caught the attention of investors. The stock has more than doubled since July when they said that this product worked in mice. And analysts say it could have about $750 million in U.S. sales, um, and the company isn't ready to give a timeline yet as to when this could come to market, but it could be a few more years before it makes its way to the FDA. There's some additional studying that still needs to be done here.